Almost 12 months to the day and family members were back on Kangaroo Island for our annual fishing holiday. Camp was quickly set up in the usual spot and then it was out in the boat for our first fish. If you want to dodge potential COVID exposure, this is the place to come. Don't want these, not what we want. When you start catching parrotfish, you know you're on the wrong bottom. It's time to shift around and try somewhere else. Certainly is. That's another keeper. Strange things happening with the weather. The wind's just done a 180, gone from easterly basically to southwest, and there's this big bank of cloud on the horizon which could even be a sea fog, which will make life interesting. We're just going to monitor for a few minutes and see what happens, but the uh, chop's definitely picking up. You can feel the difference in temperature. The sea conditions began to rapidly deteriorate, so we headed back in. So we're back in the marina now, and that definitely is sea fog. You can see it going up over the headland. It's not very thick, but quite clearly sea fog. In the middle of a day, it's just short of 12 o'clock, and the temperature's close to 30 degrees. Quite unusual. Here's the main part's gone over the top now. Not something you see every day. The next morning. So this is Hanson Bay. Very murky morning. The tides today are pretty ordinary, so I've come early and hopefully I can pick up a few fish before they move out to deeper water. This is the only real feature on the beach, to be honest. It's pretty flat, so I'm going to start off with a lure and I'll have a cast for about 10 minutes, see if I can't pick something up. And if I can't, I'll go to bait. I'm on. Not very big. I think probably a salmon trout. Yep, there he is in the shallows. Nice start. I've worked this gutter for about 20 minutes only the one small salmon so I'm going to switch over to bait and uh, really I'm very limited this is the only feature on the beach it's, the rest of it is just rolling surf no gutters no nothing so we'll see how we go it's still early so this is my rig four ounce star sinker 
filtered tail on 3.0 hooks and a surf popper and that's proved to be really successful in the surf, particularly on small salmon so let's get it out there and see how we go well I've got something I don't think it's very big but I've had a bait out there for about 30 minutes little picky bites and I think finally some little fish's luck has run out certainly not big oh it's a monster and it's on the popper not the bait it just goes to show the value of the popper little salmon go so he can go back well turned out to be quite a nice day good conditions crappy tide and very little beach formation and as a result no fish never mind find somewhere else <laughs>